His name was Geralt of Rivia. He was a witcher, a professional monster slayer. An unusual contract to lift the curse that held a monarch's daughter. It was enough to spend the night with the princess, dusk till dawn. If only she were not a deadly beast, a striga. The traitor responsible for the curse became the bait.
Though gravely wounded, the Witcher lifted the curse and gained fame. The world changed with the coming of the Great War, the time of the sword and axe, the time of disdain. Geralt of Rivia disappeared, all but forgotten. But that's another story. Ladies and gentlemen, Paranoia here, and welcome to the YouTube channel, Paranoia's Dungeon. As some of you may know, Witcher 3 comes out sometime in 2014, and it looks absolutely amazing. Now, I wonder how many of you guys are like me. I actually never played the first two. I picked up The Witcher 1 and 2 during the Steam Summer Sale, and I couldn't think of a better time than now to work my way through these titles and bring you guys a great playthrough. With that being said, make sure to subscribe for future videos of this playthrough, and other playthroughs that may show up on the channel. And, uh, you know, give it a like, help me out. So let's, uh, let's dive right in. I'm stoked. I'm just gonna rock medium for now, I think. The Northern Kingdoms nursed their wounds for five years after the Great War. Plague and famine raged, the death toll unknown. A few surviving elven and dwarven units sought refuge amidst forests, where they prepared for a final, desperate fight. Abominable beasts ruled backwoods, highways, and former battlefields alike. In cities and villages, folk were left wondering, what had happened to the Witchers? The Blue Mountains in the north of Kedwin. The year 1270. Five years after the Great War.
Everything's all right. I've no idea where you've been. The important thing is you're alive and among friends. Though you look like you just left your grave. <laughs> Little do they, do they know that that might be the case. For those new to the channel, I just want to make note that I do somewhat minimal commentary. We'll speak soon enough. We're nearing Karamoran. I want you guys to thoroughly enjoy the story. So I hope you guys like how I put things together. And uh, definitely help me out, you know. Leave a comment, what you like. Subscribe. I love subscribers. They're like mini hugs for my heart. He's wearing a necklace that has the logo. We're home. Leo, get Triss. Your time nears its end, witches. Enjoy things while you can. I'm so pumped to swing a sword. Wrong! You missed the parry! I keep repeating this. Pirouette always followed by a back cross parry. Always! Barely two days have passed since they found you. Mm-hmm. I owe my recovery to you. Thank you, Triss. Remember anything? I take it that's the werewolf? Or whatever creature that you fought in the beginning. Look below. I know the moves. Through it. Parry. Cut. It looks like her anyway. Boop physics. I can't explain it, but I feel a bond when we speak. I know you are important. Geralt, we... <gasps> Slowly at Kermoran. Ha! It worked! Not bad. Take a rest. What do you think, Geralt? Is he ready for the path? Wait for the rest. He's alone. The Professor promised 50 orange for every freak we kill. He's mine! Yeah, he is fucking their shit up. Besimir, we got company! I'm shutting the gate! Geralt, grab a sword off the training forms. Oh yeah. Man, here we go. Picking up items. Move the cursor over the sword and left click to equip. Sounds easy enough. Left click on an enemy to attack. Gladly. Oh man, the interface is so like 2008. I love it. Oh, seems the sword icon changes here. I wonder if it's like a chain attack. Oh. Over the shoulder camera movement. 
That's your typical WSAD keys. Yep, that is a combo. Awesome. How do you feel? Fine. Anyone know who the intruders are? The giddy as a beaver. Ordinary bandits would never attack Kaer Morin. That we know, Marigold. You could try some of your famous magic. In due time, Lambert. Enough! We need to check the other possible passages to the upper courtyard. Is there any kind of looting system? It doesn't seem so. Alright, upper courtyard it is. Entering your region, Bastion. What's happening? They're trying to break down the gate! They won't get anywhere without a battering ram. <laughs> oh yeah? Shit! What is that? A frightener. One mean beast. Savola. I know him. A mage as ambitious as he is insane. Ambition, insanity, and good looks. They're coming up here. Get ready! There's more! They're entering the upper courtyard! The one in glasses is the professor. Murder for hire. I sense magic. There's a sorcerer among them. Professor, you know the way. Get to it. The Professor is wanted in Redania, Tamaria, and Kedwin. A real maggot. I don't recognize the Sorcerer. Marigold, I'm interested in whether you can disarm Savola. The rest is witches. Where is it? I'll try. They're coming. I really Frightener enjoyed the off-camera there. But it's vulnerable to loud noises. The bells in the upper courtyard. Exactly. Eskel, Lambert, you'll help me stop the Frightener and the bandits. Leo, stay behind us. Geralt, you open the gate to the upper courtyard. When we're there, Triss can stop Savola and his pet while we prepare to deal with the Professor and the Unknown Mage. I'll figure something out. Let's do this. Bleed them a bit down here before withdrawing. Geralt, follow the wall and break through to the tower where there's a passage to the upper courtyard. Alone? They're just bandits. The one might be infamous. You must open the gate. We'll be waiting. Good luck, Wolf. the mini map marker to find the quest objective cool so looks like we're on our first mission <laughs> chaining attacks yeah chain attacks kill enemies more efficiently left click only when the cursor changes into a flaming sword <laughs> Yeah, it feels good to play an RPG. Oh, man, you Mess with me and die.
combat style is fast style. Use the fast style to defeat agile opponents. Switch to this style by left clicking on the cat icon or by pressing X. We'll see the X. Combat style, strong style. Use the strong style to defeat larger armored opponents. Switch to this style by left clicking on the wolf icon by pressing Z. I'll make you scream. Oh, sweet. I like the agile style. Active pause. Press the spacebar to toggle active pause mode. Well, that's convenient. I'm not sure why you would use that though. I guess if you're overwhelmed. Through here, follow me back to Savola. I'll make you squeal. Guy. Here we go. I'm not, I don't know what the game has to offer quite yet for um, exploring. Oh, well, there you go. That answers my question. Double click or drag to equip or take item or transfer all. Here we go. So it does have um, uh, a touch of exploring. Can't move this cauldron, it's too heavy. Maybe if I use some magic. I don't have any magic yet, so we'll move on. this, yeah. Well, let's keep following the, the red objective arrow on the map. Big guy. Gameplay is really smooth. I wasn't sure what to expect when I first saw it. I'll make you squeal. You know how it is when you get used to, you know, newer games and such, and you go back to a somewhat older game. This is mid 2008. There we go. 
Using objects, left click on the winch to open the gate. It's a miracle you're alive. You could have told me about the stairs. Lambert and Eskel were supposed to fix them yesterday. We're not masons. No matter. The professor and the other mage must be hiding in the keep. Face the truth, witchers. They're here to rob you. Trace, child, we have nothing of value. Some good steel, snow fox pelts? I mean the laboratory and you know it. Someone wants your famed mutagens. You're jumping to conclusions. Truth may be right. We need to find out what they want. One thing at a time. We shouldn't turn our backs on a strong mage leading a frightener. And you can't let the bandits in the lab. Right as usual, Triss. Geralt, you've dealt with mages. Find out what this one wants. Leo will guide you. Just reconnaissance, or...? No one will be sorry if some of them lose their heads. You'll manage, Wolf. Just remember Leo's with you. I can handle this. We'll see what's happening inside and be back. Take these potions just in case. Drink the Thunderbolt now and keep Swallow for when you need healing. I'll be able to tell you how they work. We'll make sure no one else gets inside. Triss, stay with us in case Savola has any new ideas. Inventory. Access items. Open the inventory by left clicking on the satchel icon by pressing I. Right click on the Thunderbolt potion to use it. Alrighty, Thunderbolt potion. Go. Right click to use. Potion effects. Move the cursor over an effect icon to see more information about the effect. You got, and you got to do the free mode by holding shift. So there we go. That's some pretty good effects. Time left seven hours. I wonder how fast the gameplay goes though. Yeah, see, every second is a. A few seconds is a minute. All right, good to know. Let's carry on. I've heard all of Dandelion's ballads about you. Lambert tells me I'll never be as fast as a real witcher. But I managed to aid him during training today. You beat Lambert? Yeah, we were fencing on the floor pegs when that strange storm came. Lambert looked away, I did a pirouette, hit him right in the gut. Uh, he didn't fall, and then he beat me. You'll make a good swordsman yet. I know. <laughs> Every time Lambert beats me, he says I have potential. So it looks like we're on our second mission. Evading enemies. In OTS mode, which is over the shoulder, double tap a directional key, W, A, W, S, A, or D to dodge enemies. Let's try it out. Nice. I wonder how leveling works. Or if there is a line, I don't even know. I know someone else. The pace of movement I really like. It's quick. And I feel like I'm covering a lot of ground. <clears throat> Combat styles, group style. The group style is most effective against groups of weaker opponents. Switch to this style by left clicking on the griffin icon or by pressing C. So yeah, I've got 
Z, X, and C right across the bottom of the keys. That's good. Oh well, I can't move on the group mode. You be sorry. Should have run when you had the chance. You can't defeat the Witcher. Okay, I guess I can. It's just not as agile. Gotta check some barrels. Let's check the kitchen. No, oh, it's locked. Anything else worth checking out? Oh, you can loot the corpses. Oh my goodness. I wonder if there's an automatic loot. I'll check later. Quick, to the laboratory. These stairs lead to the lab. Follow me. The energy you annexed from the Circle of Elements is enough to stop the Witchers? You tremble, yet you complain Savola would have them all, leaving none for you. Did the sight of a single Witcher, White Wolf himself, instill fear? The aforementioned considered dead, I might add, is a known killer. I'll gladly challenge him. Leo, stand back. Come on, Professor. Time is essential. I wield the power of the Circle of Elements. They are no threat. Back to work. I want the mutagens ready for teleportation in 15 minutes. Our witches shan't trouble us. I think we've got ourselves a good old fashioned boss off. fight in our hands. The stairs are blocked. The magic barrier looks solid. We need Triss. They're robbing us. Geralt, clear the passage upstairs. Use a sign. A sign? The Ard. I can't do it since I broke my fingers training along the gauntlet. Cast the Ard at the debris. I don't remember the signs. Let's go to the Circle of Elements, a source of the power. You need to try and learn the Ard. All right. Oh, goodness. What do I have to do? I guess we're going up the... This way? Must follow Leo. Elemental circles. Left click on the elemental stone to learn a sign. Success? We'll see in a minute. I knew it would work. Let's get back before Lambert kills the Frightener himself. Signs. Aired. <clears throat> the Aird sign is a telekinetic force useful for clearing obstructed pathways or for knocking back opponents. Right click on the uh, target to cast the sign. So we got ourselves a force push it seems like. What did you learn? The bandits are in the lab, searching for something. The mage used the circle of elements to create a magic barrier. The plague! You're all children. Why didn't you mention the circle? Triss, child, it didn't seem important. If the mage aligned with the circle, he can create a stable portal through which he'll travel to anywhere on the continent, taking your equipment with him. All right, we made a mistake, but you said the mage was harmless. I said I didn't know him. I think we should protect the lab above all. Don't panic, Marigold. We know you'd like to see our witch's secrets. Vesemir, if that idiot doesn't shut it, I'll... Enough! Lambert, stop baiting Triss. Show her some respect. Triss, if we go to the lab, they'll have us surrounded. We know tactics. Maybe we should split up. Geralt's right. We need to protect the lab and kill the Frightener. Who goes where? Only I can break the barrier. I'm going inside. Vesemir? 
I'll stay and handle the Frightener and Savola. What about you, Geralt? We may both need your help. Well, I trust the other witchers to handle themselves. I don't know Triss well enough yet, and they call her child a lot, so I'm gonna go with her. The lab is important. I'm going with Triss. Me too. It's decided then. Eskel and Lambert will stay with me. Savola just cast a spell. Something's happening. Plus, you know, boobs. The ground is shaking. Feel it? They're breaking through. Defend the laboratory. This could be a hard fight, Geralt. Take this potion. Witchers call it the Tawny Owl. It restores endurance. Very useful when fighting mages. Thanks. Let's go. So if we recall, uh, these potions are in our inventory. Tawny Owl, where are you? There we are. Significantly increases endurance for generation. Right, so we keep that in mind that we have that. You'll go no further, White One. I'll summon a powerful demon that will tear you apart. A bluff. He's exhausted from teleportation. Magic light is about all he can muster. Go. We'll deal with him and join you at the barrier. Oh, uh, yeah. Underestimating an opponent. Are up there. Awesome. I was actually worried about that, that's why I was kind of hesitant to take the Tawny Owl. Too bad. Are you hurt? Did he get you? Nah. But if those were magic lights, I'd hate to face a truly powerful sorcerer. I wanted to help, but I couldn't break through that strange circle. Savol is eating dirt. That's what matters. We need to help Triss. Let's go. I must run to the lab. Running, 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 running. Is the kitchen unlocked now? I tried. Triss, no. They're ransacking the laboratory. The other mages. I underestimated him. Hurry. My life is really low. Do I have any. Let's do this. 
Vitality seems important, right? Yeah, see my health regenerating. Laboratory. I found it. We have what we came for. <laughs> Professor, deal with those witches. I hear witches can parry bolts in flight. Let's see. Leo, stop! Ribs, punctured lung. He's dying. He needs White Rufford's decoction. Hang on, Leo. It was here. I can't find it. Vesemir, Leo is dead. How did this happen? He attacked the professor. I was late. It's not your fault, Geralt. We're all to blame. Triss barely made it fighting for us. These are bad times for witches, and something tells me they'll only get worse. Is it safe up top? Relatively. Some stragglers up there, but we'll deal with them later. You look tired. I'd like you to rest. I'll keep watch and tend to Leo's body. Meditation. Left click on the meditation icon in the dialog to enter meditation mode. Yes, character development. This is what I'm talking about. You've earned talents. Use these to upgrade character features that include attributes, signs, and combat styles. Select a feature you want to enhance from the list on the left, then choose from among the highlighted enhancements in the ability tree on the right. To commit your choices, left click on the hourglass. So feature, enhance. Let's see. Show. Attributes. I'm a stickler for strength. So it changes what enhancements are based on the attribute. So, one, two, all right, so we gotta start down here, it looks like. Damage plus 5%, parry 5%, that looks pretty cool. Let's start here. So we got three talent points to use.
these seem like situational enhancements. Let's keep using the, the passive stuff. Requires a silver talent. I do not have any silver talents. Let's do this. So I guess we gotta meditate based on what we've learned so far. Let's do it. All right, so now what? Mosses and grasses, the smell is heady. Victoria Journal. Let's check our journal. Okay, so phases Leo's death. I must explore the fortress, make sure the others are alright. So I guess we're gonna poke around for a bit. Laid me down here. Well there's Vesemir, let's see what he has to say. Eskel came by while you were resting. Triss is still unconscious, but stable. That's a relief. I've made a decision, Wolf. We abandon Kaer Morin. There's nothing holding us here. I see. We need to bid Leo farewell and wait for Triss to recover. And the bandits? Yes, we need to finish things. But first we must make a healing potion for Triss. We'll need to search for ingredients. Nothing useful left here. I can do that. How do I make the potion? Lambert will give you the formula. Look for him by the fireplace. He's with our brave sorceress. Lambert? He doesn't hate Triss? Feels guilty, I think. The first thing Triss will hear when she wakes is, Finally awake, Marigold. That's Lambert. Let's get to work. Later I'll teach you how to extract ingredients from monsters. I'll be in the main hall. Fine. Journal. Left click on the scroll icon or press J to open the journal. And we have just done this, so. Next quest, a potion for Triss. All that's missing is a mage who'd know how to use this. Right, so let's check our journal. Tutorials, nice. I need to see Lambert in the man main hall. Geralt, is something wrong? No time to talk. I need to make a potion for Triss. You should find a vial of white gull in the armory on the upper floor. Grab some calcium equum from the evening hall. Look for white stones in one of the chests. If you find any stragglers, finish them. We don't need prisoners. The stairs are through that door. I'd go, but Marigold lies unconscious by the fire. I... yeah, we're I'll good. I'll find you later. Just gotta pay attention to what they say, right? Basic alchemy. Prepare potions in meditation mode. Gather the required ingredients first. 
So we have to go to the upper level. There's a fireplace he was just talking about. Chicken. No loot. Our floor. stuff called we gotta find ah. something calcium <laughs> unknown potion let's drink it Two doors, let's check them out. this area. Bottled water. Triggers uh, labeling. That's cool. I don't think I can turn that on always. You're really, really convenient. Hold on. Or an interface, something. Awesome, there we go, object names. So that's the, all the bandits, it looks like, for that quest. White Gull, that's what we need, right, I think? Yep, quest updated. Oh, 
what's this? <laughs> it's awesome how many weapons I can hold. Let's roll. I believe this is where the other item should be. It's updated. Done all that Lambert asked. Let's go. Let's head back. There was a way to continue upward, but I'm not certain if it's really necessary right now. So we'll just head down. I'll see stairs to Triss's room. What do you need? Done. I have the ingredients. Done. I have the ingredients, and it's safe upstairs. Good. You'll need two more things to make the potion. The claw of a mighty beast, and some celandine. Vesemir will tell you where to find them. Let me teach you the formula. Okay, so we gotta find Vesemir. Oh, he's right here. Oh, that was a tough fight. I found a few intruders upstairs, but... I understand they won't be a problem. Lambert, however, let the Frightener get to him. Nothing serious. Good you went after Triss and handled that mage. She was able to salvage some equipment, but it looks like the main device has vanished. Our beautiful sorceress was right, I know. You did well, Wolf. Take this armor and sword. I've been keeping them for you. You couldn't give it to me before this shit went down. <laughs> you gotta love it. Lambert gave me the formula. I take it you already have white gull and calcium equum. I do. What next? You'll need Celandine. Take what I have. Plus the claw of a monster like the Frightener. To skin a creature, take a sharp knife and cut along the torso. You'll find the Frightener's carcass in the upper courtyard. Once you've extracted the claw, rest by the fire while making the potion. Upper courtyard. I'm guessing that's outside. Ooh, I'm looking snazzy. Which way I should be going. Oh, there it is, remains. Skinny monsters. To extract alchemic alchemical components, left click on the monster carcass. Oh, tip. Read books to gain information about monsters and al alchemical ingredients. Alright. Alchemical. Alchemical. <laughs> so we got the Frightener's Claw. And the Frightener's Eye. Now we have to head back to meditate in front of the fire. Yeah. 
Yes? We'll speak later. Left click on the vial. I think I missed something. Oh, here we go. <laughs> I was like, where is the vial? All right, select a formula to add ingredients to the vial automatically. Then left click on mix. Formula, potion for Trish. So we'll click this, click mix. And meditate. Quest updated. I believe I have to bring it to her room. Journal. Yep. We were in Triss's room earlier, so I'll head back there now. Oh wait, kitchen door. Derpy derp. Tiny ass floors. Well, hello there. Uh, uh, oh. Gifts. Double click on the healing potion to give it to Triss. See which one is it? Oh, quest item. There we go. Thank you, Geralt. I hope this potion helps. That was terrible. I dreamt Lambert was with me. He was staring at me, saying things like, Don't go dying on me, Marigold. Calling me big headed. I'm so glad to see you. What? I'm glad you're feeling better. I know we should set out, but I have a feeling we won't be back. Perhaps ever. Won't you stay just a bit longer? With me? I suppose we have some time. I suppose we have some time. I'm so happy you're back. When I saw you, all the feelings I tried to deny returned. Stronger than ever. Triss, I'm not ready to talk about the past. Of course. I, I shouldn't pressure you. I just feel so... <laughs> the powers. I'm behaving like a teenager. Let's focus on the present. I guess I disappointed you all. Forgive me. It's not your fault. Nothing to forgive. What I felt when I learned you were alive... Hard to compare to anything. Oh. Except maybe what I feel as I look at you. I missed you so. Let's see if the best bed in Kaer Morin can hold us. <laughs> <laughs> oh goodness. Ah, <laughs> oh, 
Geralt, a pleasure as always. As always? You don't remember anything? Unfortunately. Well, you have something to look forward to then. No matter. Tell me, how did the battle end? They broke into the lab, killed Leo, stole our mutagens, and escaped. Poor Vesemir. Another protege dead prematurely. We delayed the funeral until you awoke. Thank you. As for the mutagens, their loss could prove catastrophic. Let's not lose any more time. Unless there's something you'd like to ask me? Let's see. Let's try this. Can you restore my memory? I'd have to examine you. There's a good chance your memory will return on its own. How much chance? That's difficult to say. It might help if I knew what caused you to lose your memory. Well, no time for that now. Geralt, can we go? We shouldn't keep Vesemir waiting. Come on, then. We don't know where the bandits came from or who's behind them. We'll draw attention if we venture out as a group. By splitting up, we can also cover more territory. I'll go west. I know a few people there, and I prefer the coastal then climate. Then I'll head east, to Kedwin, unless someone objects. That's fine. Which way should I go? South, to Tamaria. King Foltest owes you a debt of gratitude. Some time ago, he removed a curse from his daughter. You might happen on the bandit's trail there. And you, Triss? I'll try to use my influence to find the bandits. If I learn anything, I'll contact Geralt. I'll gather what information I can and find you in Vizima. Triss. Don't, Geralt. I detest goodbyes. I'm liable to cry, and there's nothing more pathetic than a sorceress in tears. Don't get killed, Geralt. I don't think I could deal with that again. I'll see you soon. See you, Triss. Classically. Tired. It's not far now. We'll be there soon. I'm cold. We'll fetch you warm milk and honey. You'd like that. Very much. Thank you, Caroline. What are those dogs doing? Dogs? Having a snack. Alvin, do exactly as I say. This is important. Run to the inn as fast as you can and don't look back. Understand? Run! They are evil. What the hell? Shut the gate quickly! The beast! The beast is attacking! Sound the alarm!
Oh man. Geralt! Melatelli must have sent you. There's a woman outside. The dogs will tear her apart. Help her! Help! No! Don't open the gate! The beasts will enter! These dogs are deadly. You people are monsters! Stand aside! I'll save them myself! Stop. Don't go out there alone. Damn you! We're all going to die! The flow is just wonderful. Magic, surely. The beast! Geralt, look! The time of the sword and axe approaches! The time of the white frost and white light! The time of madness and disdain! To Daerit, the final age! The world will perish amidst ice and be reborn with the new sun! Reborn of elder blood, of hen care, of a planted seed. A seed that will not sprout but burst into flames. The old elven prophecy of Itlina. I hope he's all right. It seems he saved us from the beast. Yes, seems so. Oh, I do hope he's not hurt. I'll need to find someone to take care of him. He shouldn't be alone. We'll stay at the inn in the meantime. Wait a minute. I ran into wild dogs on my way here, but they were nothing like these, and I don't mean just the green fur. Know anything about them? They've been terrorizing the village for some time. Every few days, a villager is killed. The pack is led by a large hound, perhaps a wolf. People call it the beast. Someone might pay to have the beast slain. That's what witchers do, isn't it? But enough about monsters. What brings you here? I'm seeking men who wear the sign of the salamander. Seen anyone like that in the area? Shh, not so loud. There was someone, but the peasants grow silent at the mere mention of him. The Reverend might know more. You may also want to ask him about the beast. I'll do that. Did you want to ask me something? Nah. All right now. We'll speak later. All right, ladies and gents, that does it for the first part of my playthrough of The Witcher. Um, I'm going to try and keep these parts relatively long. I want to get through these in a uh, decent amount of time. So I'll try and keep it to about an hour or so. It seems like they're split into chapters. So this will be the start of chapter one when I return. So I'll see you guys then.